Hello, good morning. How are you all? I am very fine. Hope the same from your side. Today I will give you one assignment. That assignment will change your whole life. It will change your attitude. It will make you happy. It will make you more thankful. Okay, then what is the assignment? You have to write a heartfelt letter and every week. You can do it especially, you can choose Sunday because Sunday will be a holiday and you can write it on Sunday. I am not asking you to post it. No need to post it, but you have to write it. A heartfelt letter, a letter of gratitude because it is going to change your life. Okay, then you may say, okay, to whom I should thank? Thank everyone. First of all, thank your parents because they have given you life. Because of them you are able to see this beautiful world. Then you can thank all your friends, those who have helped you, your teachers. You can thank the nature. You can thank God. You can thank everyone. Whatever gives you happiness, whatever makes you happy, you can thank everyone. And why you should do it? What you will get after writing letter? You may ask, okay ma'am, I wrote the letter. What I will get out of it? If you have returned to your near and dear ones and if you want to give them, you can give it. If you have written it to your father, mother, they will feel very, very happy, I am sure. Or otherwise, if you don't want to give it, doesn't matter, write and keep it. Then what is the result? What you will get out of it? First thing is, you get a lot of satisfaction. Do it and see. After writing the letter, you feel so relaxed. So, first thing, you will be happy. You will be very much thankful and next you will have clarity in your life. You will get the clarity. Many times what happens you are knowing? We are not aware. So many things our parents have taught us, our teachers have taught us, our friends might have taught us, books might have taught us, nature might have taught us. But we are not at all aware of all these things. So when you start thinking and when you start writing, you will be aware of all these things. Okay, I will give you or I will tell you a story about a boy who had always thought that his father scolds him, his father doesn't look after him, he doesn't do this and that. 101 complaints he had about his father. Why? Because his father was very strict. He never used to allow the boy to 
keep the TV on and go out for playing or keep the fan on or AC on and go somewhere else. He was always particular that all these things should be switched off. Then only you can leave the room. The boy was habituated to all these things. And once what happened? He went for an interview in a well-known company. He was waiting for his number. As the number decreased, wherever it was not necessary, he switched off those lights. When the tap was running, even he stopped it. And then when his number came, the people or those people who were, who were conducting the interview, they told him that he is already selected. He was a little bit surprised. He said, you haven't asked me any question, you haven't seen my testimonials and how you are telling that I am selected. Then they told, we have watched you. You were so much, what I can tell you, um, aware about the waste of electricity or water and all. I want such a man to the company who will think that this institution is his own. He should feel that it is his own and he should be careful about all this wastage as well or whatever. The boy was surprised. Then he realized these are all the things, all the lessons taught to him by his father. His father never allowed him to go out keeping the fan on, having the AC on. He never allowed him. So, he had developed that attitude or that habit. So, wherever or whenever the things were not necessary, he never liked their wastage. So, he realized it. He came home, he wrote a letter. He saw his father had not yet come home. He left the letter on his table and went to his room and had a nice sleep because he was relieved of all the tension and everything and he has got a nice job today. He wrote a thankful letter to his father. When his father returned, he read the letter. Silently he went to the son's room and he nicely had a look at his son. And when he came near his son, his son too woke up and he hugged his father tightly. So what is the result or what all these things happened? It is because of the lessons what his father has taught him. So even this letter writing once in a week, you can write about anything which you have developed in your life because of your father or mother or your friends. So this letter writing, thanksgiving letter, will change your life. 
it will make you know that you had so many good beautiful people around you and how they were helpful in molding your character acha have a good day